Hey guys, welcome back to another Minecraft video, and today I'm going to be doing a mod review. Yay! I haven't done these in a while, and the one I did was a uh, pretty while back. Yeah, I just said that. Okay, then. So, anyway, um, here's the intro. Have you ever been in a survival world, and you don't have enough space in your chest? You have a double chest, but not good enough. That's a singular chest. I knew that. You have a double chest, but, you know, six rows of nine, that's not good enough. And then a regular single chest, nah, it's not even close to good enough. So, wow, my hunger is going down. And, anyway. <laughs> so, this mod adds more chests to, um... Wow, I can't even think of anything. Okay, this mod adds extra space to chests. And adds more chests. And they're pretty unique in how, they're, how they are. And I think it adds a few extra ores, like silver and copper. Except, I didn't really, um... Like, bring those from the creative inventory. I'm just guessing that they add that because there are silver and copper chests and I am dying so fast here difficulty uh, I thought it was on peaceful let's see uh, let me check nope peaceful there we go and I'm gonna give myself some food give myself some minecraft cooked beef awesome and I might have to get myself another one just because I need it um there we're good we replenished and we're awesome anyway now let's get into the mod review. So this is regular chest for lols. This is how you craft it. It's like that, you know. You probably already know that if you're watching this video. Now here's a unique chest. It's called iron chest, and this is basically a double chest in a one block. It's six rows of nine. So yeah, double chest right there. And this is how you craft it. And then unique thing, this mod adds upgrades instead of actually crafting the chest. So this is how you craft upgrade, and I'll show you how to use it in a little bit. You put one oak wood in the middle, and then iron surrounding it, and then, I don't know, just pay no attention to that. And then this is how you use it. You use it on the chest, on a wood chest, like I said, a wood iron chest. So then, it just turns into an iron chest. Bam! And then, so you craft iron chest. It's iron surrounding it, and a chest in the middle. And don't pay attention to that, because I think that's glitchy with my craft guide mod or something. And yeah, that's a craft iron chest, and that's basically it. This is a gold chest. It has nine rows of storing space. So it's an upgrade this one. Iron to gold upgrade. This is how you craft it. You craft it with one iron ingot and gold surrounding it. So eight gold, one iron ingot. And again, don't pay attention to that. I don't think that's real, but if you guys want to try it and tell me, that is fine. So yeah, this is how you use upgrade. I'm just going to upgrade every chest along we go. So... A chest along the way. Okay, I totally speak. And decide to craft a gold chest again, iron chest in the middle, and the gold around it. So basically, all these chests are um, created by the chest name, the material surrounding the chest before it. So I'm still gonna go through the recipes though. Now, this one's a pretty cool one. I, you'll probably hear some squeaking from my chair. I don't mind it. Yeah, I'm gonna lean back. That's why. Oh, okay, that's my E. Okay. Okay, sorry, this one's clicking. Anyway, back to the actual video. Nine rows and 12 per row. That is huge. And this is totally possible to use up. I have used it in survival because I do use this mod actually in survival. So time set to zero. I'm not gonna deal with the mobs. Wait, it's peaceful. Fail. Okay, anyway. So, the diamond chest is how you craft it. Not really expensive, because if you really want to surround the uh, chest, a gold chest of diamond, that's pretty expensive. And that's, you might have heard some cracking. Don't mind that. So, they have to use glass instead. You surround it with six glass, not surround it. You put um, glass on top, glass on bottom, two diamonds, and a gold chest to get the diamond chest. Then, for the upgrade, it's the same thing except with a gold ingot. And, yeah. I'm going to upgrade this chest. Yeah! awesome anyway this is actually a lesser chest it's called the copper chest and this is how you craft it and yeah iron ingots in the corners glass um surrounding that chest because you know all the space is left in there and a copper chest and i'm clicking it clicking it yeah let's go yep everywhere everywhere okay fine i'm going fast that was the wrong button i am so awesome I'm so good at this game. I know, I know. Okay, anyway, and also, I that's probably not true. Anyway, now here's the upgrade. This is a wood to copper upgrade, so I don't really have a, oh, a wood chest right there. That's perfect, and I have all these chests right here. What am I saying? Anyway, wood to copper, 
I don't know if this is true, but it's just one oak wood. I think I'm gonna try that right now. Give, give myself a uh, crafting bench, table. I'm gonna place that right there. I'm sorry. I'm trying. I'm getting a little off task, but I want to try this out. Wood plank. Uh, wooden plank. Plank. Um, oak wood plank. Oak. Wood plank. I'm sorry. I don't. I'm not used to this new. Oh my god. Oak wood plank. You know what? I'm going in creative. I. That's probably. That, you probably suffered that enough. So I am going to go survival again. Craft it. It crafts a button. So again, that is not true. This probably doesn't have a recipe then because that's kind of well. You craft copper chest like that, but. The upgrade, I don't think that's craftable because it crafts the button. I can't believe I didn't think of that before. Like, it, it crafts the button of all things, and I can't even craft it because I'm a fail. Yeah. There we go. Nope. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. Here's a button for your crafting table. Great. That was so off topic. I am sorry. Anyway. Yeah. So it has five rows of nine. So, you know, five. Why not? It's not a multiple of three, but it's five. Yes, that works. Eight rows. So this is the silver chest. It's not the iron chest, but it's better than iron chest. It looks very similar, but this is more of like a, I don't know, maybe grayish color, and that's more of a, a silver color. Wow, wow, okay. Yeah, it's more of a silver color. This is more like a grayish white color. So you can tell them apart. It's like a lighter variation of that. That's, it might be, because the borders on that, like right those borders right there, they are different than, yeah, they're, they're different. Now, to start craft silver chest, silver chest requires, um, right there. Yep, and it's an uh, iron chest. So, you surround it by four glass and an iron chest in the middle, and you get a silver chest. Eight rows again, and then the upgrade, there is no upgrade in this, like, yeah, it's probably my craft guy plugin, plugin mod being all derpy and stuff. And this is the crystal chest, and I really like this one because it's pretty, it's see-through, and you see the items inside it, and that's pretty cool because you see that there's a crystal chest inside a crystal chest. I know, ironic. And then there's also an upgrade into that. So this is where I would upgrade the diamond chest, and since I have two, that works out very well because those both go with each other. So this is how you craft a crystal chest. You surround a diamond chest with glass to get a crystal chest and then here's the upgrade. You craft it with one obsidian in the middle and glass surrounding it. Not really expensive but you know you do need to get a diamond pickaxe and get some obsidian and stuff. So yeah. Bam. Like you see gold chest inside there. Right inside there. Right inside there. Anyway, let's go back to the obsidian chest. This one looks really cool. Looks like an ender chest, but it doesn't have any particles emit emitting. No, um, kind of coming out from it. So, yeah. This is how you craft it. It's one diamond chest surrounded by obsidian. So, more expensive than the crystal chest, but very tough. I don't think it explodes because obsidian doesn't explode. And then to craft it, you put one glass in the middle, surrounded by obsidian, so that's a little less expensive, so... I just, I might, I would craft this, actually, I'd craft the, you know, that. So then, I'm gonna use this upgrade now, right on that. Awesome. That looks pretty cool. And this, oh, I forgot to put the rows. They're the same rows as the diamond chest, actually, so they just look different, and do, and are like, if you break that, I don't know if you can break it easily. I'm not going to try it. But this one, you can't really break easily. You need diamond pickaxe for that. And they're both 9 rows, 12 per row. Now, this is a very special case. You know, there's a sign that says special, but so he must be special. And then that's a helper chest. You know, just, it carries a dirt chest. So, are you ready to see what's inside this dirt chest? What is inside the dirt chest? I think I'm about to find out right now. One slot to put stuff in, and you get a book. How to use your dirt chest. Let's read it. Welcome to your new dirt chest 9000. We hope you enjoy your many years of storing your stack of dirt in our 
storage utility. Usage, simply insert a stack of dirt of your choice into the highly receptive slot and enjoy the great convenience of having that dirt available to you any time you pass by this chest. We hope you have enjoyed reviewing this instruction manual and hope you will consider using our products in the future. Kind regards to Dirt Chest 9000 Manual Writers Incorporated. Warranty this product has no warranty of any kind. Your dirt may be sto not be stored and may be slowly leach into into the environment or alternatively it might not do anything at all. Okay, uh, it's kind to the environment. Please dispose of this guidebook responsibility you and do not and do not whatever you do just chuck it in some lava. We would be very sad. Okay then. That's a long book and I can't put it back you can't you can only store dirt in there. Okay. Well then let's go find some lava. <laughs> dirt chest. Now this is how you craft it. You put dirt around a regular chest. I don't get why you'd ever want to do that. Maybe for the book? I don't know. You can't really do much with the book besides throw it at someone, you know. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go find some lava right now. So So I found a pool of lava and I don't care what this book says. You are going in right there. And so am I. Goodbye. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and don't forget to check out the mod. I will put the thread in the description so you can check out cracking recipes in case I got anything wrong because my craft guide uh, mod may have got something wrong. I don't know. But I th most of those are correct because I've actually used them. It's just the copper and silver one I'm not really sure about. But yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I already said that. Don't forget to tell your friends. And hey, look, it's snowing. That's a perfect ending. And this um, mod, you can download the mod from the link below. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy using this mod if you decide to put it in your survival because I think it's a very worthwhile mod to put in your survival. It's, um,. It adds extra chests, you know, I already said that a while ago, actually. So, yeah. See you guys later, and goodbye. Watch me burn. Yeah. Goodbye.